Welcome to my vlog. I don't know how many this is. That's a lot. It's turned into a daily thing, it seems like. More like daily whenever I have time. Anyways, I didn't have any topics again today, so I'm just going to talk about whatever. Anyways, uh, I had mentioned on my Tumblr, or I put like a blog on my Tumblr or whatever about uh, spring quarter, how I'm doing intramural football, flag football with my buddies. Uh, we did it last year, and uh, it was a blast, but we had we had some issues with it. So last year, uh, in the spring quarter, uh, I joined a flag football team with some of my friends, and uh, the second game, I, I wasn't there for the first game, but I joined the second game, and we had a pretty decent season. We had a, I think we might have had a winning record, I can't remember, and uh, going into the playoffs, because every team made the playoffs, all six teams in our league, um, I believe we were fourth or fifth, I can't remember. But we pl the team we played against, we had a better record than them, but they had beaten us before. So we were played as a lower seed than they were, which was kind of dumb. But uh, that game was amazing because it was the first round of the playoffs. We totally blew them out. It was legit. It was crazy. And then um, then after that, we lost to the team that would have ultimately won the title and uh, also had our quarterback's older brother on the team. So that was kind of a bummer, but we're ready for revenge this year. <laughs> But uh, the thing that killed us last year, though, was we struggled with having set positions on the team, as well as uh, we didn't have a playbook. We just pretty much hiked the ball, someone was open, throw it to them, which it worked against some teams, but most of the time it didn't work at all. And then in terms of positions, let's see, uh, last year, how many positions I played? I played almost all. <laughs> uh, I played receiver, I played offensive line, defensive line, um corner, safety, lineback. I played everything, it seemed like. <clears throat> uh, but this season, we decided we're going to put together a playbook, a small one at least, so we can actually like run plays instead of just like throw it wherever and hopefully it doesn't get picked off. <clears throat> but um, this year we're also hoping to have set positions. Like Right now it's looking like on offense, I will be playing offensive line, but since I am a terrible blocker, I will be playing offensive line, but shedding off the tight end. And then for defensive, I just learned out today what I'd be doing defensively. I'd be playing more coverage. So that should be interesting. Uh, if I were to start right now, I'd be terrible because uh, I just can't play that right now. I'm so out of shape. But uh, we also, my friend Parker, who's on our team, who was on last year too, has come up with an idea how we're going to be doing some, like, uh, getting ready for it, like making the plays and... Uh, practicing a bit and then even dieting which is not really fun because I need my food but then again I don't eat a ton either like I'm, I'm healthy but I'm out of shape a little bit but uh, it should be interesting uh, all next quarter we're just gonna be doing that getting ready for it so then when it comes time for spring quarter we can just go off so I'm though for exercising I really enjoy just going and shooting hoops at the gym because I'm not a weight person. I mean, even in high school, I ran cross country. So pretty much we just ran and did leg exercises for that. But it should be interesting. I mean, my gums, boom, that's all I've got. <laughs> this is going to be fun. And then dieting, I'm not too fond of eating salads every day. So we'll see how that goes. <laughs> um, anyways, that's really all I had in mind to talk about. Is there anything else? No, I don't think so. This is going to be a really short video. Dang. Uh, I, this is why I need topics, people. I have nothing to talk about. But, um, maybe I can do the question thing. I have a couple questions. Let me grab it. <clears throat> if you hit me up on my Twitter or in the comments with questions, I'll throw them in here. I'll do some of them. This is really just like filler stuff because I usually don't have anything to talk about. And nobody gives me suggestions to talk about. If it's a question, I'll put it in there probably. Most likely I'll just answer it. Um, but if it's a topic, then uh, I'll be sure to answer it as best as I can. So I'm just going to do like two or three of these, I guess. Fill it the rest of the time. <laughs> um, oh, uh, one other thing. I'm sorry for the volume issue. Uh, my last video, I had a complaint by one of my buddies. He said that the only issue with the video is that the volume is terrible and that's actually not really my fault my microphone is terrible it's a little cheap three dollar microphone and uh, I can't do anything with the volume 
I've tried multiple things. So you're just gonna have to turn up the volume. I'm sorry. Anyways, so this question is the number of kids I want. This is weird. <laughs> my girlfriend sees this video, then she'll know everything about me. Great. She watches all my videos and just Um we actually talked about this too. Like we both think two is solid. Um I come from a family with five kids. I have my sister Emily, she's like seven. Caitlin, who's 13, McKenna, who just turned 16 this past week, like two weeks ago, last week, I don't know, roughly, <laughs> 11 days ago, there we go, um, then there's me, I'm 19, and then my older sister, who's uh, 20, how old is she? How old is she? 28. Sorry if you see this, Sierra, and I said the wrong age. I don't know. <laughs> Anyways, um, coming from a large family like that, two sounds good. So it's not too many, not too few. Oh wow, that took up like two minutes. Dang, I should just do one more. Yeah, I'm gonna do one more question. The last book I read, uh, from start to finish, uh. There's a book called Blue Like Jazz. Um, I would show it, but my roommate has it. He's actually thought about reading it. It's really good. It's, um, I forgot who it's by, but really great book. It's titled Blue Like Jazz, and it's uh, like a non-religious look on spiritual things. The guy who wrote it is a Christian, though, and it's kind of just like his journey with like um, Christ and all that. It's actually a really good book. Um, he's a really funny writer. Like he even incorporates like little cartoons and twice in the book. It's kind of funny, but it's a great book. One of my favorites. It is actually my favorite. So, I believe that's all I'm gonna do right now. Uh, if you have any ideas for future video blogs, um, for questions or topics, Twitter up here. I'm really bad at pointing up here. I'm looking at the camera up there this area and um, or in the comments down below please feel free to subscribe to my channel and join my three followers or subscribers <laughs> it's great um, check out my other videos uh, especially my other vlogs you can ignore my very first video ever that was really stupid and I also did a cover of Crony Empire's Millennia uh, it's not perfect but it's pretty decent it's acoustic guitar and singing check that out on my channel uh, rate this video, share it, Facebook, Twitter, Tumblr, everywhere, <laughs> and um, comment, and we'll see you next time, take care.